You're listening to the Ask Drone You podcast. You ask, we answer your drone questions. Whether you're here to turn your passion into profit or you simply fly for fun, we're a community of learners and teachers who aspire to achieve greatness. We are Drone You. Hey everyone, my name is Paul and I am distracted by the hashtag (laughs) COVIDidiots. Welcome to the show. Yes, and uh, my name is Robin, now I am as well. (laughs) Um, (laughs) We (laughs) apparently, so are you. Anyways, we are super glad to be hanging out here with you and uh, this is going to be a fun show. I think, uh, you know, we get these questions as if you guys have not been made aware of this that get Paul a little bit fired up. (laughs) It's... Social distancing at its finest. Oh my. (laughs) Oh my. That's actually... Yeah, that's a pretty good joke. All right, well, since you can't see the joke that's on my screen, it uh, it does say social distancing, your choice, and the image on the left is a man and a woman walking six feet from each other, and the image on the right is measuring the distance from the ground to six feet under where the coffin is. Mm-hmm. Six feet of distance, your choice. Anyway, getting into today's show, we're going to be talking about what is your choice for drone mapping acquisition applications. And we've got a fired up caller, Rob. We do. And and I'm excited. I love fired up callers. I love his enthusiasm. And I'm going to love your response (laughs) because he's going to be nice. Right? Awkward silence. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we are excited Trying to speak it into existence. Yes, we here. we are excited to have you with us today and do appreciate when you upload those questions at askdroneu.com. And if you like spending time with us, well then you're going to love our Drone You live series as the coronavirus has shut down most of our live trainings other than one so far. Um, we are focusing on our online series of classes. These are live classes, so they're different from our content catalog in that you and I and Rob and you and a few other people like PJ and Matt, you get to interact with us live, including Vic as well. So if you want to join us, members get a special discount for all three live classes that are going down. And good news, drum roll please, Rob. Thank you. Rob and I are going to be hosting a business mastermind. That's right. It's time to get down and dirty. Most drone pilots, they're learning the systems to learn the perfect practice model to be great pilots. But while most people can master piloting, few can master piloting while mastering business. It's time to change that. So that's why we are going to be inviting you to our very first mastermind session. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're really excited about that. Um, So anyway, long story short is we are excited to be here with you. Indeed. So thank you. Hi, guys. I think PIX4D capture is a piece of garbage. Maybe you can talk me down off the ledge. I've tried to use it multiple times now on large jobs mapping 50 to 200 acres. And every single time it fails, this has always been in controlled airspace where I've had a DJI custom unlock. But still, it'll either fail to launch because it won't load the mission to the drone. It's a Mavic 2 Pro, and it just will not load the mission to the drone, so therefore you can't start the mission. If it does start the mission, then um, when you have to change a battery after the first battery change, it will not continue because, again, it cannot load the mission to the drone. So I really find pic 4D capture to be completely useless. I mean, it's good, I guess, if you're going to map your garage or your cul-de-sac, but other than that, I, I find it useless. Same thing with the DJI GO Pro ground station that thing has a 99 waypoint limitation. So again, teeny tiny maps, great. You gotta do something big, 50 to 200 acres. I don't know what the solution is out there. So please enlighten me, really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, Chris. So how high is the ledge that you're on? That's what I wanna know. Wow, that's quite the... uh... No, 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 because if it's high... (laughs) I don't know, Rob. That might have been the best diss I've ever heard you throw. (laughs) I was over here stunned, like, did he just say that? You're misinterpreting. (laughs) No, because if it's a high ledge where you could hurt yourself, then we would spend some time talking you off of it. If it's not very high, then we're going to roll right past it. What he's also saying is you might fall really hard off that pedestal. (laughs) No, 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 no. You're inferring something that's not there. But anyways, so, you know, the apps that he's referring to, obviously. Yo, talk me off a ledge, man. Come on. We use them extensively. We use them a lot and they work well. So I think maybe you can help him understand how. 
Well, I would say first things first, in my effort to give a Rob-like diss, I will say, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. how do you expect us to give your question credence when you're trying to map with a Mavic 2 Pro? Uh, there's my basic, basic question. So, Well, just like a 30-second why Mavic 2 Pro is a bad idea. Linear rolling shutter, I'm done. Okay. All right. Room to spare. Okay. So, <laughs> so uh, science, you know, okay. it's one of those things. So, all right. So the reason, look, if anyone's doing drone mapping, you don't do it with the Mavic 2 Pro because acquisition time is double to triple. Processing time is at least double and the results are half as good. So it takes more time to clean up the model, more time to georectify the model, more time to even acquire the imagery for the models. And while they may look a little bit prettier because of that crazy dynamic range on a Mavic 2 Pro, the results are so inaccurate and anyone who's running a business knows you can't run a business while mapping on a Mavic 2 Pro because you cannot do volume, AKA more than two jobs per week. Is, is there anything though? So maybe he doesn't want to do volume. Well, if he wants to make money, he wants to do volume, doesn't he? Well, maybe. I, look, I'm just, uh, you know me. I try to give the benefit of the doubt Many to times. our wonderful question askers. And I appreciate the questions, but this one, when someone's so fired up about an application not working. He's just frustrated. I understand that. But the frustration is easily understood. Okay. Okay, good. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Do you know why it's easily understood? Why? Because it's very clear that the person doesn't understand the basics of drone mapping. I understand. I understand. So and I'm not saying that that's a fault. Okay. I'm not. I'm not. I'm just saying, don't be like me. And when you don't understand something, don't just chop it down. Okay. Look, sometimes I do that just for dr drama that effect. That would be impetuous. That, yes, it would. So don't be impetuous. Impetuous. Yes. Impetuous. Thank impetuous. you. Impetuous. <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah, boy, I, I butchered that. But in any case. Um, and if you don't know really what impetuous point. means, then you are intellectually impetuous. Well, yeah. Okay. Anyways. <laughs> look it up. Anyways. Yeah. I mean, I think what, what we have to some, what we have to do on pretty much every show, because no one calls in and gives us every single detail of their scenario, right? Because True. there's not time for that. True. So we're not asking you to do and that. And they also don't call to get beat up on the show. No, they do not. No, they do not. But I understand. And I will say this, that when someone, when, so Chris, when you call in and, and you say it's a piece of junk, well, then, you know, you're sort of asking for a response in, in sort of a similar vein, right? I so, wish Peter was here for this. One New Yorker answering another New Yorker. <laughs> look, 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 here's the problem. You don't know what you're talking about with mapping. <laughs> huh? Okay. Like question answered. Yeah. So <laughs> anyway, well, Peter's not here, luckily. Uh, <laughs> so, um, I think it's very easy to understand. Okay. First of all, let's get into answering this question. Pix40 Capture works differently with every single drone. Most of the um, updates that they've been doing in firmware are focused on the most popular drones. They really stop supporting drones that people are not using anymore. And because people are not using the Mavic 2 Pro, some of the features that we're used to with Phantoms may not be available. Uh. That being said, he could also have the older version of the Pix40 Capture app because now you can pause a mission throw a new battery in and get right back up and it's not a problem at all so I'm like okay is my question number one have you taken a drone mapping class you probably should because linear rolling shutter is a very big deal and you cannot run a successful business with a drone that utilizes an LRS sensor okay number two is all your firmware up to date number three when you're mapping Try not to fly over people. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Random thoughts. Yeah, well, Bye. well, no, I just thought about the, doing the last, the last farms. <laughs> yeah, no, I know, but okay, I just okay. try to say that because you know, last time I was out mapping the convention center with Vic, and um, you know, I was about to cross this road, and I didn't know if anyone was there, but I had a VO, and I asked him. I said, "Am I good to cross?" And uh, he was like, "Yeah, you're good." So I crossed the road and go right back over the buildings, and keep shooting, and Vic was like. Well, huh, that was, that was really good of you. You're really thorough about not flying over people. 
And he's like, I, you know, because F.A.'s like Lucy Goosey, I mean, he didn't say this. It's kind of underlying what he was saying. Um, but he didn't expect me to be so careful about not flying over people because transversing people is, is done so commonly now. And when the FAA says you can't be safe and fly over people for commercial pilots, but they'll give literally public safety with no training a, a flight over people waiver, people are questioning the credibility here. So long story short is it pays to be cognizant of the rules and it pays to be cognizant of following the rules all the time. That's the whole idea of our new program called the props program. It's professional, reliable operators practicing safety. So uh, I just wanted to make that really clear. Going back to the applications, if he, I wonder if the first problem is he could update the application and then he would be able to continue mapping. Pixworthy Capture is by far the best mapping application on the planet. It just does not have train awareness, okay? The second best application on the planet, and it would be number one if it had Pixworthy's free flight mode, um, but the number one application for mapping that doesn't have free flight is Maps Made Easy. Maps Made Easy has this beautiful feature where if the remote loses connection to the drone, it will continue mapping. It will not stop the mission if the connection is interrupted, and it also also, it showcases a, a projection of the area it's mapping in real time. So if your GPS is off, you'll see it in real time. Hmm. So you eliminate a lot of glitches with Maps Made Easy. But again, to try to map successfully with a Mavic 2 Pro is a fool's errand. So that being said, I know if you're like trying to practice and get the hang of it, great. But you're not going to be building systems for a successful business. It's just that simple. Can you map with a Mavic 2 Pro? The answer is yes. Can you create a business and map practically more than twice a week? The answer is no. It is that simple. Okay. So everything that he is frustrated with relative to the apps and, and relative to his question specifically, those should not be issues. I mean, those are all very doable things with Capture, et cetera. Yeah. And okay. I mean, Capture, Pix4D Capture Capture is the best application. It just doesn't have train awareness. Maps Made Easy has train awareness. It just doesn't have free flight mode. And then I know some smarty nerd is going to be like, well, why don't you just use UGCS? And it's like, well, because I don't want to take a computer this size out with me every single place I go to go fly. So um, I don't want to be stuck to a laptop computer to plan my flights. Gotcha. Um, that being said. Because they don't have an app yet. Yes. Troubleshooting wise, this guy should update Pix40 Capture. Make sure he's not using it on a Crystal Sky. Make sure he's using it on an iPhone, not Android. And make sure he's using it on um, an iOS device, period, like Apple uh, iPhone or iPad. I don't keep up with Android development because I don't have an Android, but I know a lot of drone application um, companies have stopped supporting Android. And it's very simple. And when everyone on Android is like, why don't you support Android? Android. It's because your shit's not secure. It's that simple. Because guess what? If we put something up, it gets stolen in two days. It's literally, there's a market behind it. <laughs> two days. Two days. Uh, you're going to be <laughs> taken, huh? You don't even know it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, my my family is from New England. Like I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> no need to tell me anything. I love it. Oh man! All right. Well, I think we answered his question. Hopefully, you can make so. your three thirty, and that's gonna do it for us. That's show. right. <laughs> uh, anyway, thanks again for watching. Hopefully, we didn't beat you up too much. Really Just, appreciate the question. We really do appreciate do. the question. So thank you. If you have a question, go to askdroneu.com and don't be afraid to say, "Hey, Paul, don't beat me up with this question." <laughs> We've had people do that. Yeah, we have. To. And anyway, we appreciate everyone of you. So thank you. That's going to do it for us today. My name is Paul. My name is Rob. This is Ask Drone You.